And this fella here, this fella's Arthur. Well, at least you ain't run off. Real good guy. Sort of... What you talking about? Pearson left. Old uncle. The traitors. Both gone. At dawn. They said to young Tilly they were running to save themselves. I think Mary Beth left as well. So it goes. They are goddamn <clears throat> cowards. Arthur, cowards. Of all the time we spent to run off. Well, I guess they don't want to die, Dutch. Ain't nobody gonna... This is a tough time. You ain't, you ain't doing too well. But we, our community, we will survive. They will not crush us. I hope so. But if we let Jack and the women free, well, then there maybe we can... freedom for no one in this country no more, Arthur. One more big score, we got enough money to leave. All this turmoil has the army and Pinkerton spinning. We take a boat and slip away. I don't know what you're saying, Dutch, but it seems like I've heard it all before. Just one more. That's always a goddamn train. Arthur, <coughs> this is different. We know this is full of cash. Army payroll, money and supplies to repair the bridge that you blew. This is all going to plan. We rob Uncle Sam and we leave. <laughs> the poetry of it all. What do you think? It sounds wonderful. Hell, yeah. I ain't got much to lose, but you know, the women and the children and John and his family. I'm afraid I have to insist. I mean, we gotta let them go, because if the Pinkertons come through again, they will kill everyone. John? Insist? Yeah. Insist. Of course, pal. Whatever you think is best, I will. See to it. Huh? Now, are we gonna rob a train? Sure. We will survive. We will flourish. We have work to do, my friends. Let's go. Come on. We are gonna borrow a little money from old Uncle Sam and be out of his hair once and for all. We insist upon it. Insist. Let's ride out, gentlemen. Let's go. So welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Thanks a lot for joining me. My name's Mac or Chalk Joystick. Uh, so this isn't looking good at all. Um, yeah, Dutch and Arthur as far as part as ever. And they don't trust each other now. And Dutch is just on a path of his own. And Arthur just wants to get John and his family and the women just out of here. He wants okay, them to be free from the gang. So we're going to go and rob another train. The middle of a city? No, it's going to stop there, take on mail and water, let off some boys head home on leave, and then it heads out. They know the bridge is gone, Black Lung. There'll be a patrol past Annisburg, waiting down by the river to collect the money. We speak on quietly, and then we got a short time to stop the train before it reaches the patrol. Right, okay, so we'll do this train job. Um, well, if anything's uh, to go by what's happened lately, it's not going to go to plan, but we'll see. It's uh, another one of Dutch's big scores. Right, so we've got to follow John. Pinkertons have pretty much taken over Van Horn. There's a whole heap of men in there. Right, so what we'll do is we'll follow John. Uh, we'll get to our destination. Uh, when we're a bit nearer, we will see you there. There it is. <laughs> I'll get the dynamite. No, I can do it. You sure? I'm fine. Okay, it's in the back. Right, let's get this dynamite. So this is uh, the wagon we had before when we uh, blew up the bridge. Right, let's get on the get the dynamite. Okay. 
Yeah, it's always uh, the less big score with Dutch, isn't it? And it always seems to be a bloody train right. as well. Let's get this done. Right, okay. The train's on its way. So listen, Abigail just told me the money, it's hidden in the caves at Beaver Hollow. What? Yeah. So much for Nick. Brilliant. So Abigail knows where all the cash is. Dutch was getting even sloppier than we thought. Are Abigail and Jack ready to leave? I think so. Okay. Whatever happens with this job today, <laughs> wherever Dutch and them go next, we're getting you the hell out of here. We're going to get you the money you need. Knowing the three of you got out, well, maybe all of this is still mean something. Yeah, this means the earth to Arthur now. If this is all he wants to be done. I'll do whatever it takes. You've always had my back, Arthur. Well, uh, perhaps not always. <laughs> anyway, here we go. One last train, Arthur. Yeah. One last train. <laughs> So is the rest of the gang. Ah, there you are. Got everything? Yeah. Then off we go. Off we go, indeed. <laughs> One right. last time, gentlemen. I got us a river boat. We'll head up to New York or Chicago and get a real boat from there out to the tropics. So yeah, that's what he said last time. Oh, it'll be paradise, son. All coming together, Dutch, just like we planned. Is that okay with you, John? Arthur? Or do you insist on something different? Sounds about as good now as every time I heard it before. Oh, <laughs> Abigail must be real excited. All packed up like she is. I could just see her in the little grass skirt. Don't talk to me, you son of a bitch. Boys, boys, okay now, let's keep it down. We don't want to draw attention to ourselves going through here. Right, so they obviously know Abigail's been packing nice up. And easy through town, fellas. I might be looking uh, at getting out of here. Sandinie. Good to be back. Happy memories, huh, John? Please, Michael, that's enough. Fire, all of you. Oh, God, poor bugger just ran over it. Not much further now. I don't quite know how we're not being shot at. It was only uh, a few episodes ago we were uh, shooting the place up. Where I get Dutch and Micah just uh, acting absolute idiots. Mm. Very much a twosome now. Half has been pushed aside. Yeah. Hold it. All right. Cleet, Sadie, you board halfway along. John, you and Arthur are going to board at the back. Rest of you, follow Mike and I, and join once they stop the train. Here she comes. Should I just sneak on now? <laughs> God damn it. That didn't go to well, plan. Everybody mount up. We're still going through with this. Of course we are. <laughs> oh God. All right, so the train didn't bloody stop. Now we got to go after it. Come on, Arthur. We gotta get on that train! Right. We can jump on at the side! So as usual, that's his best plans so all all going to shit, really. Right, let's jump on this train. We'll be able to get on the back here. Here they pie of him shot. Go after. Right, 
Alright, let's go. You okay? Yeah. Money's in the front carry. We gotta push forward quick. Some guards on here, we'll move up, I think. Express and high velocity uh, bullets on them as well. Come on, keep going, gotta get up there. Push up on them! He's having a little lay down. Let's keep moving! Jump. I'm putting you down! Too close! Guys out. Yeah, where are they? Who knows if this was their goddamn plan all along? Yeah, where the hell are they? Seems to be a uh, John and Arthur. This is where you die. Just like the old days, huh? Real nothing like the old days. There's another one around there somewhere. There he is. The bugger. This bill. Yeah. Oh, so they were riding along. Get going, Bill. Uh, Arthur and John were doing all the hard work. Get, get back on. Get oh, back God. on, jump. <laughs> One couple of that cash before it blows us all up. What? Oh, we're gonna have a go in the Gatling gun. Oh, well, yeah. I think we are. I'm good at the old scatter gun. Doesn't mean I'm going to hit anything. Well done. Oh, on. <laughs> Bill. Oh, God. Stop the train! Whatever you do, do not 
Stop the train. You secure up ahead, but keep us moving. I'll yeah. deal with that patrol when they come through. That's not too good. Uh, Dutch has got John. We got a lot of riders on our tail, Arthur. I see him. Don't worry. Over this side. How the hell I get held with you, little lady? Watch your goddamn mouth! Oh. Lovely. Don't want to hit the horse. Or over that side. They're out there. Look out on the right! Look out on the left! Really trying not to hit the horses. God damn it! Will you shoot him for Christ's sake? What the, the hell you think I'm doing? Miss it! I don't I'll take orders from you. Yeah. yeah, we got him. Oh, the hell, it makes a mess of them. Okay, get off the gun. We need to go for the money. Right, so this is the idiot Micah brought in. Got a mouth, mouthpiece. Money should be in the front carriage. Right, go with Sadie. Hey, quick! Let's blow a hole. Let's go. The money's in there. Right. Yes, right. Dynamite. Blow this right. thing. Lance it. Right. Ignite it. Run. Here they did it. Let's get in there. We got something. We got something. Catch. Jesus, we got it. There's more. Bloody hell, Dutch may have been right. The driver's dead. This thing ain't stopping. We got to get off. Okay then, let's go. Right, jump. Oh, wow. Oh, it's like Back to the Future for ages. Jesus. We're alive, it's just about. Well, let's move. Right, so we did get a good score. Where's John? I tried. I tried. He didn't make it. That patrol killed him. He had to run. Come on, let's go. Before another patrol turns up. Yeah, Arf ah, doesn't ah. trust Dutch or Micah. So we definitely know that's a lie. Uh, Micah and Dutch said John's dead, but yeah, we know different, don't we? Abigail. I say, Jack, we hid, but they took Abigail. Who did? Agent Milton and his men took it to Van Horn to be put on a boat and tried for murder. I am sorry to hear that. We gotta let her go. John's a... Uh, well, sorry, son. Well, he's an absolute she dirty mongrel, Micah. A bunch of money, Dutch. She's just a girl. They won't do nothing to her, but me and the boys know yep. we need to keep riding on this one, Dutch. You know it. Every man here He's knows the guy in charge now, Micah. Made an orphan. It ain't like that. What is it like? I want to live, cowpoke. I still got the choice, Dutch. It's just a girl. You're right. Dutch. Micah, it pains me to say it, Arthur, but he's right. Dutch! 
Come on, boys. Jesus is gonna leave out every guy to go to jail. All them goddamn years. Come on, Arthur. Let's go get her. You and me is all we need. Let's do it. Miss Tilly. Here. Take this. <clears throat> you take this money, too. Take Jack. You wait a copper headland for Abigail and Mrs. Ed. Thank you, Arthur. You're a good girl. You live a good life down here. All right, Arthur. I'll... I'll miss... Me too, sweetheart. Me too. Jack, come here. Be brave, son. I'm gonna go get your mom. Mrs. Adler. Oh God, right. Let's go. Let's go and get Abigail. Right, so we're right out. We're putting her on a boat. They'll probably dock at the north end of town. So I reckon we should go in the other way. Sure. Yes. So we'll head to the destination, and when we're a bit nearer, we will see you there. Look, here we are. Let's ditch the horses and come up with a plan. Right, welcome back. So we're just going to get off the horses. Um, I'm going to sort a plan out. There we go. How are you feeling? I'm okay. I think you should cover me and I'll go in there and get her. Because you're the better shot, I mean. That ain't what you mean. <laughs> I can still fight. I know, Arthur. But just do it my way, honey. It's for the best. Get up someplace high, like the lighthouse or something. And cover me. Please. Okay. Right, let's do it. So Sadie's going in. We're going to cover her from the lighthouse. Get in position. Get that ladder. Uh, do we have to go inside? Oh yeah. Got another oh, this stairway. Beauty. So Abigail's in here, they're gonna try and get her before they take her on a boat. And, uh, send her to jail. Uh, where are we going? Uh, can't quite see where I'm hitting. Oh, bloody ladder. Well, you're not against it. Okay, Mr. Milton. Where are you? Oh, there you are, you bastard. See? Oh, there she is. I'm going to cover her. Are we taking them out? I think we are. It's coming from the lighthouse. Beauty. Right, where is she going? Is she going along here? Right, one there. We can take him out. There she is. She's going down this way. There's some more. Let's take him out. Nice. This is one hell of a gun. Keep going. There she is. She's shooting that way a bit, wasn't she? Ah, there's one. One over there. Oh, one there, I think, somewhere. So. That's it. Keep moving. What else she can move? She's getting far further away. Oh, there's one. Okay, we got him. up there. Oh, let me see. There she goes. There he 
this right couple here. Nice. Got him. Got that fella. Oh, she got him. There she goes. Lovely. Keep going, Sadie. She's nearly there. Get her in there. Shit. Oh, God. Go in, Arthur. Okay, Mr. Milton. I guess we're gonna have to talk this out like gentlemen. Let's go. Come on, Arthur, keep going. He's blowing out of his ass. Right, let's get a better gun. What have we got? Pump action shotgun, that'll do. Over there! Take him down! Up. Yeah, we got him. Got him run up. That's far enough, you son of a bitch! Where the hell is he? Oh, oh, now, oh god. Maybe he needs to take cover here. Get down. Don't you take another cat! Oh, you can hear Milton. Cover off. Oh, I like the shotgun. Oh, let's make our way round. Where are they over there? Oh, yeah, I've got to go over there, right? Over there somewhere. Oh, he's up there, the bugger. on the shotgun as well. Right, we're all this way now. Just want to get sorted down this alleyway. Take cover under here, quick. Sort them. Kick it. Beauty. That was Abigail then in the chair, I think. Okay, ladies, let's get out. Oh, there's Sadie down there. Oh, Calm down, oh. Mr. Morgan. Oh, it's Milton. Quite a cough. Sure. Tuberculosis. And I'll be dead soon. And you with me, Mr. Milton? You'll be dead, sure. But I'm gonna be just fine. We offered you a deal, Mr. Morgan. <coughs> Should have taken it. I'm a fool, Mr. Milton. Not all you boys have. Quite so many scruples. Old Micah Bell. Micah? You mean Molly? Molly O'Shea? Sweated her a couple of times, never talked a word, had to let her go. Jesus. Micah Bell. We picked him up when you boys came back from the Caribbean. And he's been a good boy ever since. He is a dirty mongrel. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Arthur. <laughs> Grapple with him. Using your strength, Mr. Morgan. Oh, you still have the on. dog, Mr. Milton. Oh, well. Abigail. It was Mike all along. Horrible man. <laughs> now, 
Come on, both of you. Come on, Arthur. Jesus, bloody Mike Abel. Find the horses. We need to get the hell out of here. Right, so what coming from to the Jess? left. Where is he? He's fine. Tilly's got him. Oh, thank God. Oh, where are they? I need to kill these buggers. <laughs> Abigail, you ride mine. What are you doing? Get on, Arthur. Get on, Arthur. Get on. <laughs> Come on, I'll keep going. You'll be okay. Oh, dirty mongrel I Mike on Bell. On the left. You call yourself man, you pathetic son of a bitch. Here they John. Where's John? I, I don't know. Arthur. He... What? He got killed or he what? got captured. No. I'm really sorry. No! Abigail, I'm, I was on the train and I didn't see it. No! Jack, he's safe. <laughs> Mrs. Adler will take you to him. But, John, I want you to know this. He loved you. He loved you, and Jack, he did. He wasn't perfect, but he did. You gotta go get that boy. Come on, get out of here. Arthur, what are you doing? I gotta go have a little chat before I get much sicker. No Don't you owe Arthur me. Neither of you two. Not now. You both know. <laughs> You're good women. Good people. The best. You go get that boy. There'll be time for sorrow later. If you're headed back there, Arthur, take this. I don't need it anymore. Who's that? There's a chest in them caves, in the back to the left, hidden under a wagon. Duchess chest. All our money. I know John told you I knew where it was. Abigail Roberts. I always was a good thief. That you was. <laughs> yeah, get out of here. <sighs> Oh god, this is sad. Oh, he's got his hat. One less time, Arthur. I think I said in the other episode, I haven't been this sad since I uh, watched Marley and me. The many things we learn 